Good morning, fair folk of the internet. How is everyone doing? My name is Sergeant Ruby, and today I'm bringing you a game of Domination on Plaza. I'm using the MSMC with a laser sight and probably fast mags. But today, I'm not going to be talking about the gameplay all that much. Um, I'm actually going to be talking about the Fly and I sex scandal in huge air quotes. Um, because this really, really isn't a sex scandal. A sex scandal has to in include two people, people. You know, sex. It involves two people, or possibly more, if that's your thing. But, um, yeah, I, I was watching Woody's Gamertag's videos on the, uh, on, the, on the entire situation, and he was speaking in such a condescending tone towards Fly and I. And I understand they don't get on, and I understand that Fly and I isn't exactly the most popular guy on YouTube at the moment. He's, he's kind of like Woody was back in, you know, however long it was, in JX23 what, a year and a half ago? Um, the entire situation, it's... It, it, it's a little bit fucked up, I'm not gonna lie. Fly and I, if you don't know, Fly and I was caught in huge air quotes masturbating on a pay-to-view webcam site. And, you know, masturbating is completely normal. It is a natural bodily thing to do. It's it's normal to explore your sexuality, it's normal to self-pleasure and all this kind of stuff. And the fact that people think they caught him, once again in, in huge air quotes, qu caught in qu kind of inclines that he was doing something wrong. And there was nothing wrong in what he was doing, in the way he was doing it, unless you had a problem with his technique. Um... There was, you know, if a guy wants to spank the monkey in front of a webcam, get paid for it, who are we to tell him, no, this is wrong, think of the children, think of your wife, think of your military, think of your country, this is unpatriotic, Rawr. It's not like someone held a gun to his face and said, you must masturbate on this webcam, on this website, and you must make us money, otherwise we will blow your face off. It's not like... You know, maybe his wife was in the other corner of the room watching him get himself off and getting herself off as, at the same time. You know, I've had girlfriends that have really enjoyed doing that and shit, I enjoyed doing it as well. I mean, there is nothing wrong in what he's done. And the way that everyone's going about it is he's done some sort of heinous crime. Like, you know, the, the lead singer of Lost Prophets was just arrested in... Heinous act for heinous acts involving something to do with children. I think it was sex with children. That is something heinous, that is something extremely wrong, and that is something he should be put away for. Masturbating on a webcam for money is not something you should be ridiculed, uh, mocked, uh, you know, be talked to in a condescending tone. It's not, None of that warrants the kind of abuse that he's getting. Yes, he may be on YouTube, mess. yes, he may be part of a gaming community, but I mean, shit, people masturbate on webcams every single day. I mean, shit, I've even done it. A very long time ago, well, not a very long time ago, a couple of years ago, I've done it, I did it to a girlfriend. And nothing was wrong with that. No one ridiculed me for that. My girlfriend didn't ridicule me for that. No one did anything because no one knew anything about it. But if you're going to do this kind of shit, and you're going to do it on a public website, then, you you know, you are going to expect people that you don't exactly want to watch, um, you, you, <laughs> you are going to, people are going to find it. No matter what you do, no matter how, how hard you try and cover your tracks, people are going to find it. Whether it's your government, whether it's your mother, your sister, your fucking grandma, people are going to find it. Whether they want to or not, people are going to find it. And... Just the amount of hate that he's getting for it. Or, you know, it's like the JX23 scandal back in the day. Alright, I did hear about the scandal from, obviously, Jesus. And, unfortunately, I subscribed to him after that. I'm not quite sure why, obviously, Jesus is a complete cunt. Now that I've, you know, got caught up on the whole Woody shit and everything else. The guy's just a complete cunt. 
But I digress. Um, and, you know, Fly and I isn't exactly the most popular guy on YouTube right now. He's He did his Raw Instinct video, and he's been accused of ripping off T-Martin and Woody and, you know, a couple of these tips and tricks guys that are quite well known. Uh, the guy got popular off a fucking viral video. And... Okay, I'm not going to pretend to know everything about the guy. I'm not going to pretend to know what he wears to bed and what his favourite fucking breakfast cereal is. I'm not going to pretend that I know anything about the guy. I'm just going to go on what I've heard. And... Because you guys know that if I feel a topic is worth talking about, I'll do my research on it. Before I actually consider talking about it. And... I did my research, you know, I watched a couple of his videos, I watched Hutch's vlog, I watched Lefty's video where he basically just completely fucked the guy up in the space of about three, five minutes, and it was awesome. Um, I did enjoy that video, I might actually leave it a like. Um, and the guy just doesn't appeal to me whatsoever, I watched a couple of his videos, the guy just doesn't appeal to me at all. But if he wants to self-pleasure himself whilst other people watching, maybe making himself feel like he's an object of desire, maybe he did it for the money aspect, maybe he did it for the self-pleasuring aspect, who gives a fuck what the reason was? Okay? He did it. It's done. Obviously, you know, people are, people are saying to him, you know, get off YouTube, lay low for a while, it will, it'll all die down sooner or later. And JX23 did exactly the same thing. Um, he he laid low for a while. He got, I think he got his um, partnership discontinued with Machinima. He basically went to ground for a while, and then he came back. And I haven't watched too many of his videos, so I just don't find that guy appealing anymore. And now you know he's doing quite well for himself. He's you know he's back making money. He's back doing videos. He's back doing what he what he enjoys and what he loves. So. Saying that a guy shouldn't be on the internet because of what he's done or what he may not have done, and watching all the watching the Woody videos and especially the dual com he did with FPS Kyle, I've no I noticed that when Kyle was saying th something or some, you know, Woody would just laugh like a little fucking girl. He'd laugh like a schoolgirl, and it got me so pissed off because what he was saying what Kyle was saying and what Woody was responding to shouldn't have warranted that kind of response. It would have either been prudent to go, yeah, I completely agree, or, yeah, I'm not quite sure on that one, or, you know, something more intelligent than a, <laughs> you know, sounding like fucking Yoshi on acid. Being the dick isn't, isn't the smart thing to do pretty much ever. No one likes to be a dick. Well, I say that, but... Being the dick is never the smart thing to do. But at some points, it is the right thing to do because of the situation and every situation you find yourself in, you're gonna... Someone is gonna come across as the asshole. I've been the asshole on a couple of occasions and it wasn't fun. I mean, I, I got through it. I didn't feel the need to, you know, fucking take my own life or anything like that. You know, we as human beings have a need. And, be it, you know, we have a, a need for food, we have a need for water, and we have a need for sex. And we have a need for pleasure. And if this guy was just feeling his primal, fulfilling his primal desire for good pleasure and being f made to feel desired, then I see nothing fucking wrong with it. But that's just how I feel on the subject. Other people, they're, they're not so understanding. They're not so... You know, people can be very against freedom of self-expression, freedom of self-enjoyment. And for those people, I say, shut the fuck up. Because we're all, you know, we're all one and the same. We're all fucking humans. We all have those primal needs and desires. And if we can't be allowed to express those um, whatever medium we we get off to then you know what is the world fucking coming to I've been Sergeant Moby I want to thank you all very much for watching 
Y'all have a lovely day now. Be sure to follow me on Twitter. That way you'll get all the latest from me, how many videos I've uploaded, what I had for breakfast, and how much of a hangover I had last Saturday night.